Good morning. Hi, I'm Chris Baum with Little Guy Worldwide. I'm the Chief Operating Officer for this global company that we have here. And so today we are going to be shooting a brand new video uh, talking about our 2015 Little Guy 5 Wide platform. The 5 Wide platform, even with all of the new models that we bring out and all the changes, the 5 Wide platform still has remained a consistent staple to our product line. It is the number one selling overall uh, trailer that we have and, and has been uh, since our inception. The 5 Wide is only going to weigh around 900 pounds, queen size mattress, um, platform across the front. It's like I said, it's the staple of our product line. It's the easiest trailer that we have probably um, to tow of any of them. So it, I think it's going to continue to be that way. Uh, the exterior, you've got about five or six different pattern graphic wise, uh, which is available on the website for you to see. In addition, we've got all kinds of colors uh, for the graphics to match up your vehicle. Pick a color, we can do the graphics for it. So as we come around to the front of this trailer, this trailer is. Uh, since we've gone to a more of a package system to make ordering a lot easier both for you and the dealer, we've gone to a basic package, a quick start package, and a max package. This is a little guy max package on this, so you're going to see a lot of different standard features to that package um, for you to be able to choose from, like I said, to be able to make your ordering even easier. On the front of the trailer, you're going to see some outlets up here. This is called the AC Prep Kit. Uh, we're getting a lot of people that need air conditioners now. And, and they're doing a really nice job with the redesign uh, of the uh, of the pet cool. What, what's the name of it now? Climate right. Climate right. Climate right pet cool air conditioning unit. <laughs> what is it like? Fifty five hundred BTUs now. Fifty five hundred BTU air conditioning unit. Portable unit, all weather exterior that can sit on the front of your trailer. You are going to need a power hookup for it. So you're going to need a generator to be able to plug it into a, a source at a campground, or you can add an outlet to the front of the trailer to uh, be able to provide power. But that's what these two outlets are for are for the Climate Right uh, AC unit. You're going to have your standard platform across the front, marine style deep cycle battery. I think it's the best battery out there right now and it's going to be the longest lasting for what your needs are going to be. Um, when you get your hitch and wiring done on your vehicle, make sure you get a seven way connection, run a charge line from the battery back to the wiring harness, uh, two inch ball, and ideally when you're having that set up on your vehicle, it's going to be about 16 inches off the ground is going to be where the, from a pulling standpoint, the ideal height is. Real easy, you got your wheel jack on here, you pull the trailer over, lower it on, lock it into place, and you're going to be good to go with that. If you've got any questions about it, when you see your dealer, they're going to be able to help you out and, and walk you through that process. As we come around to the side of the trailer, um, you've got a 110 30 amp outlet on the outside of the trailer, 25 foot power cord comes standard with it, um, which virtually any campground that you're going to go into, that's going to be what works. Like I said, as I go through some of these features, these are standard features with the Little Guy Max package. As we slide to the inside, uh, we've gone away from the trifold mattress and now we've gone with the two mattress setup, similar to the Tag and the Silver Shadow model. So that's what you're going to see in here. They fold on top of each other, so you've got a lot of storage space on the inside of this trailer. Um, with this Max package, the standard stuff that's going to come with it, you're going to have drink holders on the walls, uh, window shades. The window shades are awesome. They just slide down to provide, to provide all the privacy you need so you can hide whatever you're doing in here. You just like the dark or whatever. Um, they are available in gray, black, and tan window shades, standard with this package. Um, as you go around the inside of the trailer, you've got your three-speed electric fan vent, which is standard with the power package, uh, your power converter box on the wall. 19-inch uh, sight and sound package, DVD, CD, AM, FM, um, and then like we had talked about with the tag, some of the standard features that are going to come with this now are on the interior, you've got the USB port and extra outlets. As you can see with the 2015s, we've kind of redesigned the cabinetry a little bit. You've got flip-up, reach-throughs now on your cabinetry on both sides. Um, you've got extra storage space here, you know, some redesigns, you know, I, I think they're pretty cool. Um, once again, this side flips up so you can go through to the back. Uh, LED lights all the way through, built-in speakers in the ceilings. This Max package is really going to have the majority of the things that you could possibly want uh, with a Little Guy 5 wide platform. All these features are also available in our 4 wides, our 6 wides. Um, so keep that in mind. It's just not the 5 wide, but it's also our other Little Guy models. Did I miss anything in there, Dill? No. 
Walk around to the side of the trailer, you're going to see your coax hookup for your sight and sound. So if you're at a campground or somewhere that does have uh, regular TV hookups, you can plug into that and watch standard TV on the inside of the trailer. As we come back to the galley area, once again, all LED lights. Love these lights. Really bright and illuminating uh, back here. Uh, with that max package, sink stove is going to be standard. You've got your 12-volt, uh, uh, 110 electric pump sink, 5-gallon water container, which is built in to the uh, rear fender area of the trailer, 2-burner propane stove. Uh, from a propane setup, you really just need like a little 5 or 10-pound disposable canister, get a little Coleman setup or something like that. You don't need a big tank for what you're going to be doing. Um, this That will hook up down here. Under here, 2-inch rear receiver. Uh, it, it's actually a part of the frame. People use it for bike racks, extra storage racks, uh, anything along those lines. Keep that weight around 125 pounds. I don't think you really want to go over that and you really shouldn't need to with all the extra storage that's available with this unit. Uh, you shouldn't need that. As we showed you before, the reach through storage area so you can access it from the interior or the outside of the trailer. 12 volt hookup, 110 hookup in the back. Uh, just set up a new, uh, Dylan, just set up a new dealer in Las Vegas. This trailer is getting ready to head his way here in the next couple days. Uh, really excited to have that dealership up there. We've really needed one there for a long time. And I think they're going to do a great job for us. They ordered two loads of trailers to get started with. So if you're out in that area, make sure you stop out and see them. Uh, with the little guy uh, five wide platform, 13 inch alloy mag wheels are going to be standard with this trailer. Uh, spare tire is also available. It can be mounted on the front or underneath if you feel like you need the security of having a spare tire with you. Uh, queen size bed, 900 pounds. The box of the trailer is about five by eight. Really easily towed trailer. Um, you've got a rail around the doors too. This little install kit for the screen rooms uh, is compatible with our five by seven or 10 by 10 screen room tent. Make sure you add that to the trailer. Uh, it really expands your living space, sewn-in floor, um, privacy shades, screens all the way around, easy to set up. 5x7 can be set up by one. Uh, two people really need to be able to set up the 10x10 screen room. When you go see your dealer, make sure you add that on there. And uh, also the teardrop locks. When you're going to the online store, make sure you check out the teardrop locks just to add the extra security. Dylan and Joe are adding stuff to the online store on a regular basis. Um, there's all kinds of stuff popping up on there that when people order it, I've never seen before. So make sure you spend some time there. There's some really good bargains on the site. Talk to your dealer. Um, make sure you get out and, and spend some time with your local dealer. Uh, as you know, we don't sell retail direct. Everything goes through our dealer base. So make sure you, you check out the website, call around, find your guy and go see them. Uh, it's an incredibly busy time of the year. The dealers are loaded up with inventory. They have some great deals on 2014s and then there's also the 15s out there. So uh, thanks for visiting. Spend more time watching me over and over and over again, which is why I know what Dylan likes to do on a regular basis to start his day off and make sure it gets started out right. So uh, thanks for visiting. Go LittleGuy.com and give us a shout when you need us. See you.